Fort Hall is just a ways up the trail, along the Snake River. Have you ever been there, Captain Jed? Many times. Been coming to this spot for years, way before old Nathaniel Wyatt even built a fort here. Yep. Brings to mind the very first rendezvous. Of course, we called them rendezvous back in 1825. We met near here, at the junction of Henry's Fork and the Green River. Beaver was a plenty, prices high, and no one much bothered us at all. It was Ashley's idea. He didn't want to have to travel so far to trade. One year, he lost a keelboat, sank with $10,000 worth of furs and supplies. Next year, he had trouble with the Arikara Indians, so he spread the word about a central meeting place to trade and called it a rendezvous. That's French, you know. Trappers came from all over. Indians, too? You bet. We traded with the Indians for furs, blankets, and other supplies. Many a trapper even traded for an Indian wife. Really? That's right, Cassie. I was once married to a Shoshone Indian. But that's another tale. The Rondi in 1826 was held around July 4th. You never heard such a ruckus. Guns are firing, horse racing, gambling, sharpshooting contests, wrestling, and I'd say many a patriotic toast. Wish I could have been there. Oh, but those days are gone now. Last Rondi I heard of was in 1840. I miss meeting with trapper friends, old Jed Smith, Grizzly Adams and his trained bear, and of course, Moses Black Harris, best yarn spinner I ever heard. With more and more folks heading west and needing expert guides, seemed the perfect fit for us trappers. So you became a captain and led our pa out west. Sure did. Best decision I ever made. Great man, your pa.